I should probably bitch about uh, fucking DVD cases or something. Yeah. Uh, also, I seem to have died in this game. <laughs> Eco cases. Do I like them? Personally, I think they're deplorable. I honestly hate them. I don't see why game developers even use them at all. In all honesty, all it does is just cause damage to the disc and make it so that I don't want to go out and buy another copy or even play it, so if I can't play it, why would I want to go out and buy the damn DLC for said game as well? It defeats the purpose. It's counterproductive. Sony's got the right idea. Freaking smaller cases. Yeah, Sony. Their PlayStation 3, their PlayStation 4, even the Vita. And the PSP, as much as people hated the disc design, the cases were smart. Smaller casing means less plastic, meaning less money. Where you got like Nintendo and Microsoft, they're like, let's just use regular DVD cases, like, boom, Xbox game. Now in case you're wondering what the hell I was actually ch complaining about, this is it in particular. These eco box DVD cases. Now you can see here, you can like stick your finger through them, like you could easily scratch the disc just by touching the plastic. They're very twisty, so they could break. Now I don't see an issue with it being on the booklet side, but on the disc side where basically the most valuable part of the game package is, this could cause some serious negative effects. Now, I think one of the personal best examples I can give is with my copy of Call of Duty Black Ops here. Like, you can see there's a crack along the disc, little bits of plastic that have chipped away in the center, and technically, this isn't from me playing it personally, this is from, like, friends and cousins not being very responsible or careful with taking the disc out, and just trying to pry it out. And the thing is, those discs really have a really good clamp on the disc, but at the same time, uh because the disc case is so floaty when you're bending it you wound up bending the disc with it and it can cause it to crack that's often why I'll replace game cases with sturdier DVD cases the minute I get them now just as a form of uh, something I do although I've noticed lately blu-ray cases have started doing this too it's even more baffling especially with double disc cases where it's doubly risky, because the thing is, yeah, sure, you've got the one side that's got slightly thicker plastic, so the disc is going to be a little bit safer, but you've still got that problem that you're going to run into where you're going to potentially break a disc. And I hate it! Now, do I see eco boxes going away? Hell no. If anything, I think they'll be around to stay for a while. But do I still think that they should be gotten rid of, or at least toned down or altered in some way to maybe make them more consumer friendly? Yes, I actually see that there is some benefit to eco boxes. Because of they, the fact that they use less plastic so they're better on the environment, and also, long run, they're also cheaper for the publishers and distributors to package the product inside of. But at the same time, if they don't change their tune on this whole eco box thing anytime soon I feel that it might be detrimental to the industry as a whole not just video games but also movies and PC software as well now mind you I can still see digital being a viable means so I don't see it hurting them in the long run but in the short term yeah it could potentially hurt some business here and there but anyways, I'd like to hear some of your guys' thoughts on this matter. Leave a comment down below. Until next time, this is Timothy, signing off. Bye-bye for now.